you know, I think the adjustment's coming fine. Whatever, whatever structure uh, any coach decides to do, you need to work on and give people an understanding of their roles. Uh, right now, we, we are looking at a 4-4-2. At a but at the same time, we've got um, Drew just got called up yesterday after his first training in a 4-4-2. And then, uh, of course, Adrian's not here. And then uh, Delio's, uh, you know, still injured, and we don't know if he's going to be in there. So we're, we're still wanting to work the structure. Uh, the personnel might be the issue. Uh, I felt pretty good. Um, obviously, I didn't feel uh, like I was fully fit. But, um, you know, I felt uh, as good as it, as it has in this whole entire rehab process. And, uh, you know, overall, it just felt really good to get back out on the field. And, uh, you know, my legs uh, weren't quite there for me. But, you know, luckily, I only had to play 30 minutes. And uh, just glad I could help the team get a result. And hopefully, you know, I'll start uh, getting my fitness back uh, a little bit more this week. You know, I think I think as a coach, my, my whole philosophy has been that I'm a teacher. And uh, being a teacher, you should teach. And if you let things go too long, if a person has a math problem that they're trying to uh, find a solution to and you let them go too long, they'll never get the solution. In fact, they'll probably get you know, messed up. So I try to stop it, correct it, freeze it, and then just get it going again. But there's, there's a risk to stopping it too much because then people get bored. There's too much interruptions. There's no flow. So uh, being on the national staff and doing a lot of coaching education throughout the world, I, I think I've gauged that pretty well. No, uh, I don't. I don't think there's any difference. You know, I think the uh, the whole feeling around the locker room is, is optimism, and I think everyone's pretty optimistic. You know, about the rest of the year, and and everyone's feeling good. I mean, we all have confidence in Chellis, and, and you know, we had a meeting um, for his first training session, and, and everybody seems to be uh, really trying to catch on to, to where he wants to take this team. And um, you know, the uh, the number one goal is to win a championship, and as long as everyone's on the same page, um, I think we'll be all right. And uh, you know, it started with Chicago. Um, last week, and, and now we just got to carry that to New York, who, uh, you know, is a good team, tough team, and, and they're obviously looking for results. They haven't had the best form lately, but uh, I think they're they're a good team, so we're looking to get a win.